We are in North Georgia, I believe, just like right off the border of Tennessee. We spent the day at a city park that had internet, so I could work most of the day. And um, I found this spot, which is in, I think a national forest. There's some trash around. That's been kind of the theme at a lot of these free campsites. So we've been cleaning that up at all the places that we stop. Um, yeah, it's really beautiful. It's right on this river. So I may, because there are three bars of internet, there's a road here that would be suitable for biking. High chance, if the weather is nice and it doesn't rain, that we'll actually stay here for two nights, which has not been the theme. We've been moving like every single day, unless we're staying with people. But this spot is really nice. Um, I heard on the radio that there's a chance of rain, so kind of playing it by ear like we have been. <sighs> Excited. Still in Georgia, North Georgia, at that same camp spot. Um, and since I'm gonna stay here again tonight, I decided to get my bike down and change the chain because after snow sitting on it, it just rusted out, so. Got a new chain and we're set to go. Okay, it's probably not very exciting to people who work on bikes all the time, but it's only like the third time I've ever changed out a bike chain and definitely the first time I've ever done it completely alone. So it's an exciting moment for me and I need to be learning more about bike mechanics. I know that it is, it's pretty straightforward. I mean, like now that I did it again, I was like, that was easy. It took a little bit, it was a little hard to get the rusted chain off because it was like frozen in place, but I'm very proud of this moment. Today was one of my favorite days. I don't know, I've had so many good days on this trip. Um, but it was just really relaxing. Um, and it was nice to stay in one place a little bit longer because we've been like really moving, moving, moving on this trip. Um, but since we had a little bit warmer weather, it was really wet because it rained all last night. Um, but I really didn't stop us from doing things. I waited for things to dry out, fix my bike, and then... We biked a little bit in the afternoon. I worked most of the day and it was nice to kind of do like more of a normal schedule that I usually would. And it kind of gives me the night to just relax. We had a nice dinner. The dogs are really pooped because they did a lot of walking and adventuring. And then we went on a bike ride. And tomorrow we will move on. I am debating whether or not to like work for a little while during the day and then pack up and leave and i'm kind of leaning towards that because i can kind of like crank out a bunch of work and then we can drive a little bit closer to atlanta where i'm going to visit a friend not in atlanta proper but just on the outskirts um 
and I'll just kind of go from there. Gonna kind of play tomorrow by ear and see how I'm feeling, but I'm gonna guess I'm probably just gonna stick around and work. And we'll keep on moving through Georgia. Before we get to all of that though, I do wanna make a few quick announcements. First, as many of you know, at the beginning of January, we launched an email newsletter that comes out every Monday, the same day as our podcast episode release. So if you wanna stay up to date on the latest from the Outdoor Minimalist team, you can subscribe to that newsletter by heading over to theoutdoorminimalist.com. Mm -hmm. 